parallel world to our own is Silvernell! And within this world lies the Titan Peaks, a treacherous formation of rock and war. Many years ago, when the war died down, there were still those on both sides who wanted to prove their strength. So together, they found common ground and formed a Colosseum. A place where anyone could enter and fight to the death to become the greatest warrior. If you can survive, your name will ring throughout Silvernell as the greatest warrior that ever lived. Tonight, eight new challengers have climbed the staircase up to the high peaks of the Silvernell Thunderdome! The Thunderdome is a single elimination competition. Eight warriors will go in, but only one will come out victorious. Here's how it works. Our warriors have been separated into two groups, Group A and Group B. Group A begins our competition on Session 1. These four battle it out until one is defeated. The very next session, Group B's turn. Once again, battling it out until one is terminated. The remaining three from Group A fight on our third session, and the remaining three from Group B fight on our fourth session. On our fifth session, we bring together the two remaining warriors from each group in our quarter-finals event. One will perish, and the remaining three will move on to our semifinals on session six. Our last two champions will then come together in Session 7 for our final Ultimate Showdown, where the winner will be crowned the Thunderdome Champion. Welcome to the Thunderdome! I am your Dungeon Master for the night, Scott Nicholson, and let us all rise for the Thunderdome Anthem, presented by Caroline Seegers! And you'll find up the Titan Peak stairs. There's a test of great strength and power unyielding. Every race come to prove that they stand with the gods. Only one. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Thunderdome. Tonight is a very exciting night. It is Group A. We have four fighters come to prove their worth. So, uh, before I talk about anything, I want to quickly introduce these four amazing fighters. So first, we have Margaret Alice as Smite. Please introduce yourself. Hello, I am Margaret Alice, and tonight I'm playing a uh, Oath of Conquest Paladin. Uh, Warforged named Smite. Smite is a prototype Warforged from the Canterville Kingdom Initiative Program, part of a unit to des designed to aid Vael. Is that how you pronounce it, Scott? Vael. Vael. Sorry, I knew I was going to mess it up. <laughs> <laughs> she was part of a unit designed to aid Vi the Vael Kingdom in the upcoming Great War, built to conquer and to win. She was stolen, however, from the storage barracks by an extremist cult of Helm who sought to utilize her in their holy wars. Now devoted herself, the cult has sent her to the Thunderdome to be a beacon of Helm's might, and she will mess you up in the name of Helm. Ladies and gentlemen, Smite! 
Ah, crowd goes wild. Yeah. And now, Damn. in this corner, Logan Connell will play Dooga Dooga. <laughs> Introduce uh, yourself. Yeah, we we'll have a uh, Duncan Duca, Duncan and uh, Duca. he's a yeah, he's a half orc um, fighter. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and let everybody know subclass Eldric Knight. So uh, he'll have some surprises. I did not think of an elaborate backstory, so kudos <laughs> to you, Margaret. But, uh, yeah, um, let's just say he's from uh, the Colbrador area. He's been traveling around, and uh, he's heard of this tournament that's going on, this big Thunderdome fight going on. Um, he likes a good fight and a good challenge. He's a big, muscular uh, half-orc. Big, uh, big chest, big pecs. So they call him the Double D of the East, <laughs> Duncan Duca. <laughs> And uh, he's here to just like kick it. ass and take names. So um, Borderline family friendly. Here we go. Hopefully be your champion. <laughs> Dunga! Dunga! <laughs> Audience goes wild. Ah! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, in this corner, Cody Stone is... Oh, how do you pronounce this, Cody? Karan! Karan! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Right, so uh, Karan over here is, uh, is a dwarf. Been in the hills, um, doesn't like people a whole lot, but he likes bashing them. And so they were like, you know, you could get paid for that. And I was like, whoa, whoa, laddie, me can get paid for bashing. And they was like, yeah. And I was like, whoa, all right, let's do it then. So coming out of the hills, we are uh, carrying nice fiery red-headed dwarf doing a bit of uh, druidic magic in the uh, in circle of the wildfire. So we... Uh, don't want to be mean, but uh, some of you got to burn. Oh, oh ladies oh, and God. gentlemen, Caron! Ah, the, uh, the torches on the side just get a little bit bigger. I like it. <laughs> and last, but certainly not least, ladies and gentlemen, my Discord's not letting me click his name. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Jess Bardsley is Olaf. Oh. oh, my name is Or. Oh, excuse me. So my name is Olaf, and I'm a barbarian. <laughs> um, and I throw axes at people. That's kind of my deal. I come from a far away land called the Mafia, and I'm ready to wreck some stuff today. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this girl stands up in the crowd. You get it, girl. You get it. Brittany, you sit back down. This is my moment. I don't need any of that crap from you right now. Sit down. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Olaf. Ah, crowd goes wild. Now, ladies and gentlemen, as you all stand and walk into this humongous 250 feet long coliseum where the audience goes up in every direction like a humongous football stadium, everyone's going wild. You see, standing around the edges, these human-like figures bowing in white robes. Ladies and gentlemen, the Thunderdome clerics. At the end of every round, when someone goes down, the remaining champions will be fully healed and brought up multiple levels of experience so that they may be stronger for their next battle. Also, he's going to put up a uh, uh, point up into the air and everyone's going to look up. And there's going to be a bird, like in front of the sun, cast a shadow on these poof, 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 these wizards floating in the air, appearing with their hands up. The Thunderdome Wizards! With their power, they will alter, change, and manipulate the course in which our champions will fight on, making it more interesting for us, so it's not so easy. Now, you should beware. You must stay within the Thunderdome when you fight. You cannot go beyond 200 feet up in the air, or 100 feet down in the air. And due to the magic from our wizards, you are not able to touch people in the audience, or alter the Thunderdome walls itself. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, light the torch! This huge torch on top of the Thunderdome flames up and a big phoenix rises and turns to ash and floats like confetti all over the crowd. The audience goes wild. You see elves, you see dwarves, you see every race you can think of. Not a Warforge, because she's brand new here. But uh, all these different races... And with that, roll initiative. Let's go. Let's go. Well, are we gonna are you gonna get us over to our tokens first? So they go in the turn turn order. Uh, yeah. What are you asking? 
Are you going to get us over to where we can click our tokens first so that the initiatives go in the turn order? Uh, oh, good point. <laughs> I see what you're saying now. I was like, I see it. <laughs> <laughs> really oh, boy. Yeah, that is big. All right. <laughs> That's big. So, uh, yep. Nice. <laughs> oh, my God. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. It's fine. I like uh, getting to watch my competition first. <laughs> That's a huge field. That is so big. Big, yeah. All right, yeah. Um, Dunka Duka, what's your initiative? Everyone's initiative is low. Holy crap! <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Oh, I got so Cody funny. rolled a five. Or right. Caron. Caron. Uh, would you roll Dunka Duka? A five. Oh, really? <laughs> Everybody's initiative was below six. Yep. All right, so you two Good both start. got five. So what Long is it? Highest start. decks? Cody, you know this. I know you know this. Yeah, plus two would be the highest decks. Looks like we both have a plus two, so it would be a roll-off. A roll-off! <laughs> D20s for both of you. Uh, oh. That looks like him. Dunka yeah, that's goes 20. first. Um, as you guys stand there and watch, you, you, the crowd is going wild. You can barely see all the way across. The wizards are going to uh, scatter above the the dirt and put their hands down, and poof, 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 the dirt just kind of shakes and slowly turns into very fine sand, like you'd find in the Middleton deserts of Silvernell. And in four distinct corners, it drops into large whirlpools of sand going down into the ground right before your eyes. With that, Dunka Dunka! <laughs> I'm wild. Oh, it's four squares, is five feet? No, we're not doing that anymore. We're not doing that anymore. Okay. You're muted. Can't hear you. I apologize. So Dunka Duka uh, is going to look out across the field. He sees these four whirlpools, you said, of mm -hmm. sand. Yep. Okay. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. I guess he can barely see his opponents. So he's just going to dash to the right here. Let me see how far can I go with a dash. I guess uh, 60 feet, right? So I can go there to that square, which I shall do. Anything well, else? Like right there. Uh, Dash, and that shall be it. He's just going to start making his way around mm -hmm. this field, picking out his first opponent. All right, Karan. Great. So, uh, Karan over here. Uh, oh, looks like we're going this way. So, we're going to move 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, right around over here. And uh, we're gonna take a think about having a spill, but uh, we're gonna we're gonna hold off on it for now. Um, <clears throat> so I would like to uh, prepare. Uh, I'd like to prevent casting an infestation in case anybody comes within thirty feet of me. Oh, very nice prepping that move. All right. Yeah. Okay. Olaf. I right, so uh, Olaf's gonna look up and around, and he's gonna be like. Whoa, this is way bigger than I thought. I can't even see anyone right now. Brittany, sit down. I know you're about to stand up. How'd you do, how'd you do that arrow thing, by the way, where you can, like... It, the measuring tool along the um, menu that should be on your top left of your screen where you're currently on the mouse. Underneath is a paintbrush. Underneath is a magnifying glass. The next one down is a little ruler. Kind of thing with a circle. Yeah, snap, if you to snap. toggle to that, snap to center. Yeah, and then you can drag from wherever you are to wherever you yeah. want to measure. Yep, you got it. Um, let's see. I can go up to 60 feet. What's your movement speed? It is... If it's 30... Uh, 30, so 30. Okay. Yeah, then you can use gotcha. your action to dash until 60. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Um, dun, 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 Olaf dun, is going to dash... here. Oh, wait. How do I move? Here, I'll, I'll measure. You have me. to go back to the mouse so you can move okay. your character, your token. You can kind of get about here, maybe. maybe. That's, that was 50. 
right here. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna stay here. Okay. All right. That's it. Smite. Smite. I'm way over there by herself. Hello. And, she... <laughs> <laughs> and she's gonna stay over here for now. I'm gonna hold my action. Okay. D oh, Dunka. Uh, Dunka Duke is up. Dunka. I guess kind of. Um... It's not too far away. Notice this Olaf kind of moving in that direction. He sees his first opponent. You know, he's lining it up. You! You are dead now! And uh, he's going to start making uh, his way that way. So, uh... Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. I don't want to get near that. No, you don't. All right, I think I can... Uh... <laughs> yes, you do! <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to see a good point here. Let's see. Yeah, watch yourself. <laughs> I think I'm just going to move uh, four. I'll dash, but I'll move 40 feet. Okay. So about right there. Hang on. Uh, can we move the like your Morvik picture? Because I can't see where he's... How do I turn that off? What do you? How do you turn what off? Uh, your Morvik picture, like Scott N is blocking like a part of the... Oh, reason, uh, so go down to the little gray bar with the name on it, and you can go all the way to the left and click it and drag it to where you want it. You can also go into your settings with the setting wheel and change the setting for the avatar to names only, so it will get rid of that big image box. Cool. Thanks. Yeah. Alright, is that it, Dunka? Yeah, he dashed over there. That's going to be it for him. Caron. Alright. Uh, we're dancing, we're dancing. We're going <laughs> to yep. keep on dancing, right? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. And, uh, right, we're going we're gonna to prep the infestation. Just going to be real easy, me and the me and the sand pit. You and me, sandworm. You and me. Karen hasn't quite figured it out yet, so, you know, there we go. That's it. Alright, <laughs> Olaf. All right, so Olaf is going to look at his target. He's going to be like, you really think you have a chance against the man? And then he's going to... Um, let me see. He's going to move right here. Well, not right here. Okay. And can I hold up my shield? Yep. You got. So what do you have in your hands right now? I have a great axe and a shield. So your shield's going to require one of your hands, so you can't do the two-handed grid axe. Okay, I'm just going to... Can I switch off? Like, do I have, like, my yeah, other Yeah, you can switch it off, me? but it'll okay. cost you. Gotcha. gotcha. Okay, I'm just going to hold the grid axe and the shield for now. And raise the shield. Okay. All right, smite. I'm good. Smite's going to stand still. <laughs> All right, as before everyone starts going again, the ground is going to start to rumble. And before you know it, these other holes break out into the sand. Oh, fuck. Hold on, I'm not done. <laughs> oh, boy. Seemingly into an abyss. Okay. Dunka. Fucking Dunka. Dunka sees him coming. Um, the throne properties for a hand axe. I'm just wondering from this distance if I could just pull out a hand axe and and sling one at him. It's 40 yeah, feet away. From it's a throne me. object. Yeah, I have two of them. So, um, and unless he picks it up, puts it in his bag, you could go pick it up <laughs> if you miss, or even if you hit. You know, depends on what he does. With yeah. It. Yeah, Dunk is gonna, uh, you know, see him. Uh, Dunk does think I can kill you, and uh, he's gonna pull out a hand axe and sling one at him. <laughs> All right, first attack of the night. Let's see it. Just adding decks here, I believe. Yeah. So D twenty. Um, you're a barbarian. Wow. If you're a barbarian, you're proficient in it. It's a simple. No, I am a. Ah. Uh, yeah, so that thing goes right by his side, like five feet away, and just lands r right there. I mean, a fighter would be proficient in a, a hand axe. Oh, basically. very disappointing. Weapon. 
Donka will move. Fighter is. Ten mm -hmm. feet. Then yeah, you yeah. Can still add way. your proficiency bonus. Um yeah, Donka moved ten feet that way through his hand axe. Um, That's all I can do right now. He's got a shield still on his arm, at least. But... Sandman! Mr. Caron! Right, uh, here we go. So we're just going to dance our way a little bit further. Right, 5, 10, 15, 20, 20, 5, yeah. We're going to try to, to thread the needle here with these, uh, <laughs> with these deep, deep dark cores. <laughs> And um, as I look at the hole, I know they go down into the abyss, right? Mm -hmm. But uh, is there like a side to the abyss, or is it uh, is it just like uh, like a void? So uh, they these holes look different than the four that mainly appear, because the four ones are uh, kind of slopes that gradually get bigger. It's like a big whirlpool, right, right. but these go straight down. Okay, okay, well, uh, or, yes, okay. We we keep the uh, with the infestation. Uh, preparation. That's what we got. All right. Olaf. All right. So Olaf is going to move right next to uh, DD, double D here. And I'm going Come to swing back, with bro. my great axe. One handed? Yeah. All right. All right. So uh, I don't think you get. Cody, remind me. Is... Hmm. He's swinging a, a great axe with one hand. I mean, it, if you allow him to do it at all, it would be a disadvantage. Yeah, okay, disadvantage. That's what it would be. What's a two-handed weapon? Yeah, it's a two-handed weapon. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You have two hand axes that are one-handed weapon. So you've got the shield yeah. in this, like, humongous thing that you're not proficient with doing with one hand. So you'd have disadvantage, but you can still do it. Get a six and a 17, so... Um, so it's a six. Either, so that either way, is... Yeah, either this way, AC too great. Um, and activate rage. Swings and he ducks, and rage has popped already. Here we go. Why not? You got three of them. All right. Sorry, my bad. Swinging on him, bro. Swinging on me. All right, Smite. Uh, I guess I'll start moseying my way over there. Make Maybe. My way down, I down. <laughs> I just want to just let them come to me. <laughs> it's a big yeah. arena. You got to start making moves. Do you, actually? We'll head down here, I guess. All right. Um. Then I'm also gonna go ahead. Oh, I'll wait till I'm a little closer. I think. Never mind. That's it. All right. Before Dunka Duka moves, the ground starts to shake, and this looks familiar. Much larger holes. Start Jesus. to appear as oh, the sand geez. is falling into a big cheese like pattern. Fuck. <laughs> if you opened one up right where we were standing, I was going to be like, <laughs> What? <laughs> and you're dead. Well, that was fun. Well, that was fun. Dunk. Oh, Alright, Dunka Duka. Alright. <laughs> Um, all right, I need to, uh, hang on, I gotta switch between pages, but, um, I know what I would like to do, so I just need to double check it real quick. All right. Also, for people watching us on stream, if you are new, hi, welcome to the Adventures in Silvernell. Uh, we stream our regular campaign on Wednesday night at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every week, so just a little side commercial in there for you. Sorry, Dunka. Okay, no problem. Uh, Dunka is going to take an action surge right here. Mm -hmm. um, so I'll have two actions. I'm going to spend one action to cast Grease uh, underneath. Um, it's a 10-foot cube, pretty much. So I, I don't want it to involve me, but I want it to grab him. Like, okay. basically be centered right there in those four. How and, big, um, you say? It's a 10-foot ten, ten cube. 10-foot radius? Or just 10-foot no, corner to corner? 10 foot cube. 10 by 10 uh, four, by 10. Four, no, no, no. Four by four squares here. Or, I mean, two, you know, basically four squares here together would oh, be a 10-foot cube. But basically centered on him. Uh, or not centered see. on him, but um, like... centered there where it grabs him, not Dunka. So like that? 
No, that is way too big. Okay. Just ten, just a ten foot cube. It's just four squares. Oh. <laughs> ten by right. ten. There. There you go. Yep. Yes. Uh, so that'll be underneath him, and then with my section second action, I'm going to uh, I'm going to swing a one handed warhammer at him. So, All right. Uh, I have That's resistance to bludgeoning, so. Um, That's so when nice. The... Go ahead. When the grease appears, each creature standing in the area must succeed a dexterity saving throw or fall prone. Yeah, I was going to say, isn't something happened? On the start of their happened? turn, I think. On the start when of the, turn. When the grease appears. Okay, each so, creature. so go ahead yeah. and roll a dex saving throw. Even better. Well. What do you roll? What do you roll? 12. He hit it right on the numbers, so Ty goes to the runner. Uh, I guess. Are you rolling at advantage or disadvantage? So on your character oh, sheet, Jess, at the top, uh, let me look at your sheet really fast. Let me fix this for you, because otherwise you're just going to take the biggest number every time, and that's not going to be really fair. All right, let me fix this. Um, advantage toggle. Okay, now if you look at the top of your sheet above your initiative, it should say normal, advantage, and disadvantage. If you're going to roll either one of them, advantage or disadvantage, click that. Before you roll. Do I have advantage on this? No. 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 Okay. It should just be normal dex, dex but, saving throw. We'll count, well, the 12 will be fine, but um, next time, just... All right, yeah, so, uh, yeah, he just needed to beat a 12, unfortunately. So, uh, he's still standing. He's slipping uh, around, but he's got that focus on, what is her name, Becky? Every... In the audience. Brittany. 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 Every time he starts a turn in there, uh, he has to roll a deck saving throw as well. So really? end, ends his turn in there. Oh, ends his turn. Uh, so I can move out. out. I can just walk out of it. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Um, second action, uh, I'm going to take a swing at him. I think I already clicked it and rolled it. I don't know what it was. Uh, seven. The one-hit Warhammer, seven? Fuck, it's seven. So yeah, that that's a be. miss. So we're just stealing off on each other and not hitting each other. Yeah. Um, that's all I can do. He was around. He was one place, and then he slipped, and he was another place. <laughs> well, that's that going to be like, and we're getting nowhere fast, bro. Yeah. Bro. That is... Um, actually, uh, with my bonus action, with Shield Master, I can shove him with a, I can shove him. Nice. After an attack. And I'll make him roll so, another dexterity saving throw in Greece. Depends. That's fair. What, is a, what does the shove do, basically? I was trying to find You knock it. him five feet back. Or is it ten okay. feet? Uh, I think it's just five. I think it's just five. Yeah. So I'll just uh, use my bonus action to shove him with my shield five feet back. All right. So <laughs> I believe that's you roll your strength, and then he rolls his strength. And it's basically whoever higher. Is that right? I'm not sure. I didn't know if there was any. It's like a shove. It's it. a shove, basically. It's just that's, shield. That's how you do a grapple. So if you want to run it like a grapple, then yeah. Oh, it's like uh, well, I'll look it up. If you just tell me I how you do a shove. I would so, I would assume um, that the shove would just be a dexterity thing, but it's your call because it's your game. You attack with your action. Uh, you can use your bonus action to try to shove a creature five feet uh of you with your shield. So to try to shove a creature within five feet. Right. Of your shield. So yeah, okay, I gotta try. Actions shove using an action. Uh, you make a special melee attack to either knock it prone or push it away. If you're able to make multiple attacks, you can use one for that. Target must be no more than your size category. Instead of making an attack roll, you make a strength athletics check contested by the target's strength athletics or dexterity acrobatics check. The target chooses the ability. Uh, you succeed automatically if the target is incapacitated. If you succeed, you either knock it prone or push it five feet away from you. So Okay, so it's a step go. further. It's not just strength, it's athletics. Gives you a strength little more or athletics, it. yeah. So go ahead and make an athletics, and then does he get to choose what it The said? defender gets to choose what they roll. Gotcha. So, just... so the, the attacker must use athletics. The defender gets to choose athletics or acrobatics. All right, I just rolled athletics. So a fucking I... nine. Ooh. These are, I mean, Ooh. excuse my language, sorry. So just Ugh. roll in athletics or acrobatics. Which whenever you I can't want. use. I can't use. Oh, I'm not using strength. Okay. You can. Nope. Athletics is strength. Oh, great. All right. I'm going to roll strength with advantage because I'm in rage. No, no, no. Roll athletics, which is the strength it's modifier in strength athletics. Modifier. Oh, I see. Yeah. I see. Uh, but it is so still does this count as a advantage. strength saving throw or a strength? Uh, no, check? it's just. No, you just straight just the ability. Yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a check. Off. So he does have. Oh, he does not right. move. Yeah, he, Nope. Not he 20. He's sturdy. You don't even touch him. 
Dink. Good job. Yeah. Well, that was rude. Ugh. That was rude. <laughs> All right, uh, Karan. Right, so we're going to keep on moseying. Here we go. Right, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Whoa, oh, feels like I've been going forever and I'm just not getting very far. <laughs> but uh, you know what? We're going to we're gonna stick with it. We're prepping the infestation. We're just going to keep on keeping on. That's what we got. All right, Olaf. Yeah, uh, Olaf. What's up, Olaf? <laughs> fight me, fight me. doing there? All right, so Olaf is going to be like, oh, this is kind of nasty, this this stuff you put under me. Uh, I'm just going to walk away from it. Walk to his right. And he's going to drop his shield. And he's going to swing with a great axe on the two hands. All right. All right. So uh, okay. would this be with the advantage or no? This is just regular. Yeah, this is just a regular attack. All right. Great axe. Ten. Ten ain't gonna do it, I don't think. Swing and a miss, right yeah. over his head as he ducks. Wow. This is, there's a D20 whole lot of nothing dice. going in this corner. Yeah, a lot of D twenty dice sucking ass. All right, anything else? Right Got any bonus actions to do? Um, actually, actually, you're you're raging, right? Then you would get advantage, yeah. right? Uh, it's so. if he makes a reckless attack. Oh, so if he makes a he reckless. Would choose, gotcha. Yeah, is he it would too late for me to do that? Yes. Yeah, right. you've already rolled it. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just ignore what I did? <laughs> Dang it! Um, we're trying to we're trying to hurt each other. Um, he's gonna right. look at Olaf from the crowd and be like, "You suck, Olaf." Olaf's gonna be like, "Brittany, I said sit down." And then he's gonna. <laughs> All right, smite. God. All right, I'm gonna chug along another thirty feet ish. Uh, and that's all we got for now. All right, before Dunka Duka, can anyone guess what's going to happen? We're not going to have any field left to fight on. <laughs> Is it fight in your movie? Yeah, you're going to fall in a hole down there. <laughs> More holes everywhere. Oh, God. The field is disintegrating before our eyes. Oh, can I get right up to you? Yeah. This is just the Olaf and DD show right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> Group stage. How's anyone even going to get over here? All right, Duncan. Right. There's a gap right there. He can make it. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, sh shit on a biscuit. No. That's... Three curse words Language in four words. sentences, Logan. <laughs> Make him lose health or something. Facebook, please stay with us. We've warned him. He's he's gonna be fined ten thousand dollars for every time he does. Yeah, that. I will. Okay. Um, <laughs> that was already one of those. Uh, Dunka Duka. Duka, I love it. He's gonna take his five foot step around this grease. I guess I can move right there. Um, I'm going to poison spray this gentleman right in front of me. You take this! And I'll hold up my hand and uh, poison spray. Give me a constitution saving throw, please. Get him. Um... I'm assuming not with advantage. I don't really know when, when I'm supposed to have advantage or not. No. Uh, I appreciate you asking every time. You just... Can I have advantage? Okay. <laughs> Can I have advantage? God. He saved. Gosh, is, guys. So poison just all in his face. Uneventful. <laughs> poison all. I mean, we're trying to hurt each other down here. Poison all he's in his face. He's going to brush off his hair, and he's, he's going to be like, wow, again? Really? All right. I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> then, uh, yeah, um, no, I can't. Uh, that's all I can do. I can't spend my bonus action. Gosh, Aaron. Let's hit each other. Oh, right. uh, enough. Okay. Here we go. Oh, party. did did the hole in front of me go away? That's scary. Oh, right. uh, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. Uh, we're gonna go like this right here. Okay, <laughs> you two are looking good. Stay right there. Good, don't guys. don't move. You're you're doing great. Um, and uh yeah that's we're gonna prep infestation and that's that's it 
Oh, crap. Man. All right, back to our saga. Worlds. <laughs> He's going to hit me now. He's going to hit me now. All right, is it my turn? Okay. Uh, that's the way with my great act again. Don't you do right. it. Don't you do it. Would you? Oh. No. oh <laughs> Woof. I'm dodging oh, these no. things. Oh, it's okay, Donka, we're just practicing. We're practicing yeah, for later, okay? We're putting on a good show for the audience. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> uh, I'm going to give a really, really mean glare to Brittany. <laughs> Brit Leave Brittany. She's doing nothing for you. Smite! <laughs> All the way on the other side. <laughs> Crap, and I should have done it recklessly, too. I forgot again. Yeah, I hope you forget next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna write like a little sticky note. <laughs> cool. Alright, I'm done. Miss Smite? I don't know that sticky notes exist at this time. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, may I stick it out? A guy in the audience, they don't! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs> go for the best. No. Or something. <laughs> no, I can't go that. I don't want to go that way because I don't know if I can get through. I'm gonna go this way. All right. What? Uh, either way, I'm next to something. <laughs> Got it. So you look to your right, and it goes straight down, and you just hear oh, the emptiness down into this vast hole. But like five feet to your left. The sand is sliding down into this giant bowl shape, but you're good. I was built without human emotions. <laughs> so you observe. I do Correct. not care. That's right. You won't be disappointed when you get crushed later. Oh. All right. As okay, Karen. As soon as, <laughs> as soon Whoa. as, uh, before Dunka goes, in the very middle of a field, a little blue bottle just appears out of the air as one of the wizards jumps down. Oh, and this bottle starts glowing. The audience cheers. Dunka. Oh man, I should have gone that way. <laughs> well, that's over there now. <laughs> My bottle. Hey, there's a bottle. <laughs> Hey, oh, hey. Yep. All right, is it Dunka's Dunka's turn? Yeah. All right, Who Dunka's gonna. Who knows what's in it? Cody's gonna have guess... us all talk like this. I'm guessing Olaf is pretty tall. Dunka's kind of tall. What I, I I can't remember what I made him like six foot something. But uh, yeah, I guess he'll look up at Olaf and be like, "You're so boring," and he'll spin his action to disengage, which is what gonna take me what five feet back. Mm-hmm. And then I'll spin my movement to uh, five ten. Hey, you get back here. 15, 20, 25, 30, and I want to pick up my hand axe. All right. And um, I think that's all I got. Yeah. Chiron. All right. Uh, okay. Let me see. Uh, it's, uh, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. All right. If I have counted correctly. I should be able to stand here, yes, or am I gonna fall in this hole? I, I do that? Uh, you, it's about it's about like a foot and a half in, so you've got like f like three and a half feet to stand. So we'll uh, say you're pretty good. Okay, all right, all right. For if, now, if, for now. If, if, if for now I'm okay, then uh, then we give it a try. Uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna focus on uh, this man and uh, hit him with the. Uh, Oh, with the initiation, that's what we've been doing the All whole right. time. So oh, uh, that is a uh, constitution saving throw, and I went Norwegian instead of my <laughs> Scottish one before. <laughs> but, uh, that's me. That's what happens when you get nervous. I need a so, con so. con save. Con, con save, save, buddy. Con Come save. Come on. Be a high number. Thirteen. That saves. That is. Oh. It oh. <laughs> it's falling down the hole. I it's bet it. you just saved by the skin of your teeth. Dude. I know something. I'm willing to. Yeah. Uh, get out of here, bugs! No, <laughs> no bugs. All <laughs> right. Warlock now. I just Eldritch blast people in the holes. It'd be crazy. Anything else, Karan? Uh, I am going to. I do have things I I would like to think about, but I'm going to. Think about them very carefully to myself. 
Um, <laughs> Oh, I so I can actually do this. That's a cantrip. I would like to... No. I'm good. I'm going to hang out exactly where I am. Shield is out. AC is is as good as it can be at the moment. So. All right. All right. Let's go with that. Olaf. Um, so Olaf is a little bit offended that he walked away like that. Um, I disengaged. <laughs> <laughs> and I ran. Offended <laughs> that he disengaged How like that. How dare you walk away from me? How very dare you? Olaf is going to flip his hair again. Uh, he's going to be like, I'll deal with you later. Um, <laughs> and uh, I'm going to walk up to here and I'm going to throw one of my hand axes at him. Oh, shoot. Uh, Dunka? Uh, what do I roll for that? Click just on just your... click on one of your hand axes on your sheet. It'll roll it for you. Oh. Blocked it with a shield, bro. Shink! Uh... We are really terrible at hitting each other, so that's why I was just like... It I'm gonna... almost lands in the hole. Like, it doesn't, but it almost... Like, right behind him. Let me find an axe. It lands like right there on the edge. All right. Goals make me anxious. Does it? Um and mental. Uh, <laughs> just gonna chill. Smite. Okay, she's gonna. I will choose to dash now, and she's gonna move down thirty feet and then over a little bit. Show me the path you used. Because there's a difference in that one and a half foot. One. All right. One. Two. All right, yeah. You j you're b b walking the tightrope, but you make it past. You're good. <laughs> all right. Uh, is that, I assume that's all because you used your action? Or your Correct. Action? I, used right. I used dash. I don't have anything else. Here comes more halls. <laughs> the ground is falling beneath you. Everyone, give me a moment for the whole escalation. The whole escalation. What's wrong, guys? It's family stream. <laughs> <laughs> I know, man. I'm sorry. Anywhere. I'm trying. I'm trying to watch my mouth. My father was a sailor. Just uh, if that's a good enough excuse for everyone out there. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> my dog just destroyed his rope toy. Oh my god. Alright, I've gotten really whole ha uh I'm not gonna say that. I'm good now. <laughs> <laughs> Dunka <laughs> Okay, Dunka is uh I guess he he clanked that you know, that hand axe off his shield, uh but he's gonna take a look at uh the dwarf over here. Did you just send bugs at me? And uh, I'm going to throw my hand axe at him. So, uh... Alright, roll it. Slinging a hand axe at your... At your, at your face. Is that the first hit of the night? Oh, how <laughs> the about that? The first hit! Do a, do a hand axe at you. Hit you with a 21. Uh, I'm Damage. hoping it does. So it should be at disadvantage because the hand axe's limited range is 20. And Ooh. I am oh. further... And twenty feet away. Okay, nice. I can re-roll that. Good nice. job, good job. I should have thought about that. Rules are important, Dunka. Even yeah, though me, I uh... cheered like I didn't know them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm put disadvantage on. I'll re-roll it. All right, so I'm seventeen. That... <laughs> yeah, seventeen still hits. Still oh hits. my god! Yep. It's only a one d six plus four, but uh, eight damage. Oof, an eight. Also, uh, if you've if you've rolled with your um, with your character sheet, you can click on the name of if you click on hand axe in the in the chat, it'll roll your damage for you. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. I rolled the hand axe and it rolled the attacks, but all right, all right. Right, well, but uh, if you click it in the chat instead of on your sheet, oh. the, that, then it rolls the damage. Oh, okay. I see. I see what you mean. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Is that it, Duncan? Eight. Eight damage, uh, so I threw that at you, and I'll laugh at you, ha ha ha, and then I'll take, uh, fuck, uh, 
Ha ha ha! <laughs> yeah. Very short. I'm gonna move, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20. Shit, I don't know if I wanna do that. That's all I'm gonna move. Move right there. Alright, Charon, the revenge story is strong. Alright. One, two, three, four, five. And that's not going to be helpful. Um, <clears throat> damage. So, uh, Karan is going to. Uh, I'm going to beast shape. That's what we're going to do. And we are going to become Norwegian again. <laughs> Just in case you were wondering, uh, we're going to be shaped into an ape. Um, and because I ape is a medium creature and has hands, uh, I will defer to the DM. But may I keep my shield in apish defense mm -hmm. of my dwarvish body? Yeah. Awesome. So uh, that is my action to be shaped. And then my speed is 30. I do have a um, climb speed as well, if that assists me in any way. <laughs> A.K.A. I if I fall down a hole. <laughs> right. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, right there. Sweet. And uh, I did that out of order. So order matters. Never mind. We're good. Go for it. You're fine. You can do your bonus action. Uh, I was going to cast bonus action healing word. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, okay. So it's just a uh, 1d4 <laughs> plus 3 for my healing. Right. That is 5 hit points back. All right. All right. All Thank right. You. Olaf. So Olaf is um, kind of pondering his situation a little bit. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Was that the Pirates of the Caribbean theme? Yeah. You know, it always sounds it, like the beginning. It's <laughs> stuck in my head. Uh, and 15, 20, 30. <laughs> my <laughs> ex! <laughs> no! <laughs> Hits it while he's trying to grab it, falls in the hole. <laughs> no! <laughs> That's the end of the first round. <laughs> um, Anything else? I said that's it. Didn't pick up. Oh, the mic. sorry. Spite. Oh. Okay. Uh, so, Spite <laughs> would like to. Uh, I'm gonna move. Yeah, I'm gonna move down this way, and then for my action, I would like to attempt via an athletics check to parkour over this across the wall putting my feet up on the wall to get around the edge of this hole oh hell yeah I feel about that. roll it <laughs> roll that's interesting. awesome interesting i hope you succeed <laughs> natural one what the heck? Oh, roll, a, roll a dexterity saving throw i say it all right, so as you run up the wall, you slip and hit the wall and kind of flip around because of your metal feet or whatever and grab on, and you're holding on to the side of the edge of that hole. Great. Oh, no. Right. Like, right. <laughs> <there>. Real close. <laughs> this is At bad. least we know that breaking the barrier of the hole doesn't do anything. That's I'm true. Hanging on to the edge. They have solid edges. <laughs> How'd the first pull person die? Up. Better pull yourself up. <laughs> All right. Before we begin. <laughs> no. Come on, man. I'm gonna take, take everything away. <laughs> uh, this uh, big whirlpool over here just completely collapses in. Oh, shit. All right. Don't go. Um, alright. This might be a little sketchy, but, uh... I basically want to dash. And I kind of... I don't want to come across this hole, but I know this is a thin needle. You know, to kind of come here. To about this point. Mm-hmm. 
and then uh, that's 30 feet, and then take the other 30 this way. All right, roll me a dexterity saving throw. Oh, brother. <laughs> this is normally where I'd say, I believe in you, you can right. do it. But <laughs> All right, <not> 14. <laughs> so you, you do save uh, like back up here. You're able to get around the edge. You're fine. It okay, kind of picks, was... slips your feet up beneath you, but you're able to like shuffle your way back up and like stand on the solid ground. All right, so if I was dashing, do I still have my other 30 feet of movement? Yeah, you can still go. 14's good. I like 14's. Okay, um, so I guess. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25. Shit. Can I stand Logan. there? No more curse words, Logan. <laughs> I mean, all right, all right, shoot, shoot. Your father's Shishkabob. occupation has no place here. <laughs> Shish kebab. Uh, can I stand there, though, on that spot, or should I? That's what I'm wondering. Yeah, you're fine. Okay. Sand's only down like am... a foot of that five feet. I'm there, though. That's all I can do. Karan. All right. <clears throat> so, looking for my for my measuring tool here. There it is. Right. Snap to center. Yeah, give me this. Can I eat dashing as my uh, apish self go, right? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Right? Can I, do I need a check to make that 30 feet first? Um, no, because your gorilla has a climbing speed, its foot, when it goes down, kind of sideways grabs onto that wall and pushes to get momentum. Right, that's the monkey goodness that we wanted. <laughs> there it is. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. And then we're going to dash for the other 30. Right? 5, 10, 15, 20, oh, no. 25, 30. Within five feet, can I pick up the potion with the bonus action? You can. Right. Oh, it is yours. Uh, within the, the Thunderdome, magical items are identified immediately. No uh, attunement is required. You immediately recognize it as a uh, health potion. Nice. All right. Monkey see, monkey grab. <laughs> Olaf. I'm done. It's me, guys. Um, so he's. Uh, oh, what happened to the potion? Um, he picked it up. It's like yeah, he picked it up. up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'm good, guys. I'm I'm good. I'm present. You tell um, Brittany to go home. She is too distracting. <laughs> yeah. I'm looking right at you, Brittany. Stop it. All right, you see the guy at the very top who's sitting in that big chair kind of stand up, and a bunch of guards kind of go down the big steps where he's at. And you see in the crowd, the guards are shuffling through the crowds, and they pick Brittany up by the arm. She's like, no, no! And they pick her up, and they take her up to where the guy in the chair is, and he just hmm, looks at you. And they look like they've got her as their prisoner. And you just see him mouth the words, Brittany. you better survive. I care about Brittany. I hope you do your worst to her. Oh, She's you don't work. like her. Oh, sorry. Damn it, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> All right, what Very are you confusing. doing, Olaf? Fighting the environment more than the, each other here. Um, yep. <laughs> uh, I'm going to walk over here, grab my hand axe. Um, All right. Just like Olaf. And I guess my rage ends, right? Because I'm not, I didn't attack anyone. Okay. Um... Wait, how, how far was that? Five, ten, fifteen, twenty. No, no, 25. just let your rage end in in t uh, a minute, which is ten rounds or ten turns. Well, ten rounds in. Well, ten the rounds. the rage the rage is but is that just geared? Okay, I'm I'm okay with it. Um, all right, and that's really all I can do. All right, smite. Do I need a strength check to get out of this hole? Yeah, I'll let you have athletics. No, nope, you're perfectly that? fine with that. <laughs> <laughs> you're out of the hole. <laughs> Choose which direction you're All going. Right. Okay, so I'm out of the hole. Which di Choose which direction? You did it. You just did it. Oh, but I mean, could I have chosen a different part of the hole? Uh, the alternative mm -hmm. was here. Oh, I gotcha. Because <laughs> I was like... If I could come out on the, this side of the hole, that'd Flip. be really cool. Oh. 
<laughs> just hand over hand it uh-huh. <laughs> on the edge. Okay. So we're going to go one, two. Do I need to make a dexterity saving throw if I'm going to try to go between these? or is there No, there's space? five feet. Okay. Uh, somewhere about there. All right. And as a bonus action, I am going to go ahead and cast... Uh, I am going to cast Armor of Agathis, Ooh. which will be effective for the next hour. Five temp hit points. Yes. Right. Sweet. All right, Dunka. Dunka. Bad monkey, that potion was mine. And uh, I'm going to cast um, Firebolt at him. Now we're talking. Yes. Uh, so I can't really click it on my sheet because um, I couldn't add it into Roll 20. Or I had to add Eldric Knight into oh, Roll right. 20. But. Just roll your spell, spell attack, attack is a plus four. Yeah, plus four. So, uh, I don't know. 13 is probably not going to hit him. Miss. Armor class of 14 with the shield. Ah! Uh. Ooh, ooh, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Goes um, flying past him. And then I'll take some movement to kind of reposition myself around this hole. So, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Oh, 30 right there. And All right, that's, that's oh, my turn. Olaf. Shoot, man. So Olaf doesn't really know who she, he wants to target, uh, but he has a personal vendetta against Dunka here. Cause he <laughs> and <laughs> nobody, nobody walks it. away from Olaf. Bring it. it. Nobody. Uh, she, he's <laughs> he's going to walk up five... 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, just to the edge of this hole. Uh, and can I throw my? Do I have, can I throw my axe at him? Is that too far? If your axe, you'll have disadvantage because it's thirty feet and twenty. It's a, yeah. I think twenty to sixty, so you can go uh, up to sixty, yeah. but it'll be disadvantage after twenty. Yeah. Um, Olaf's just gonna stare angrily at Dunka. I thought it was under me. Sorry, go ahead. Huh. Oh, go ahead. You're fun. I, I thought it was underneath there. that advantage within the range normal and past the range at disadvantage. No. The first number is the range up to you have uh, that it's a flat roll. Anything from the first number to the second number is at disadvantage. And you anything can't more shoot. you can't do. Yeah. 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 Otherwise, yeah. I can shoot a thousand feet. Yeah, really. Just a disadvantage. All right. If you if you have things like um, sharpshooter, you ignore the range penalty for the first yeah. increment. Smite. Gotcha. Thank you. Okay. And after Smite's turn, the Thunderdome will take a restroom break. All right. Um, I'd like to try to take a running uh, leap with my dash to get <laughs> over this little gap here and land on the other side of the hole somewhere in uh Yeah, 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 yeah. Here. Yeah, yeah. Roll an acrobatics check. Okay. Oh my god, please don't fail me now. <laughs> All right, just saying, guys. Please this goes... Don't... Okay, she's fine. She's uh... fine. <laughs> yeah. She's fine. Okay. 14's okay. good. Okay. If, if this is how Risky someone plays. dies, I just want to go ahead and say, it's not me. <laughs> yeah. That was awesome right there. The like, like, beautifully. Okay. She's, she's right Probably here. Probably got a crowd favorite right, right here. You're almost like the, <laughs> the robots in iRobot with Will Smith. They're like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> diving. <in. laughs> All right, guys. Uh, if you're watching us on stream, uh, stay tuned. We're going to take a quick restroom break. We'll be back in about five to ten minutes, depending on how our bladders go. <laughs> Sound good? Yep. Sure. All right. Be right back. All right. So we're just going to jump back into it. How's everybody doing? Everybody good? So. Um, doing great. So the, uh, the beginning was fast and furious at first before we started uh, trying to attack and stuff, and we didn't get to talk about the prize. So the winner of the entire uh, Thunderdome will get $100 sponsored by Santi Styles. Santi Styles is a boutique style clothing place in the Asmar Plains. 
Um, they've just <laughs> now changed management and released their ban on magic. So Santi will now start selling magical clothing, uh, including <laughs> invisibility clothes. Santi style, because style is key. Okay. You're amazing. I will also draw a detailed uh, character drawing of the winning character, and you will get 10,000 gold pieces uh, for Silvernell if you play with this character in Silvernell. Cool. There's a lot on the line. That's, oh, and, that's amazing. And for the multiple parties that are in Silvernell, uh, your name will be brought up as uh, a greatest hero in all the land. That's the real prize. Glory. And fame and glory. All right, so as we jump back in, the wizards uh, ascend in this big circle, almost like you look up and they're synchronized swimming in the air, and they all just pour this glitter down over top of the field, um, and you all feel this tickle. But that means that all your uh, attack hits are now critical. All right, let's jump back into it. Oh, my God. Wait, what? One, one <laughs> sec, one sec, one sec. It is... Back up, what does that mean? That means every single hit is a critical hit. Which means okay. you will roll your attack dice, multiple, uh, you'll double it. Alright, Smite had just so, jumped over this cavern. Is that the end of Smite's turn? Uh, yeah, because I moved more, so I think that's an action. Mm -hmm. I don't know that I have anything else I could do as a bonus action, so... I'm going to go with yes. All right, Dunka. Okay. Dunka can kind of look behind him and see that he's about to get uh, pinched in here. Yes. <laughs> so, um, I think this might not be good. Actually, Dunka's just going to stay where he does recognize he's getting pinched in, but, um, He's mad at this uh this gorilla for taking his potion. He just sprinted all the way over here. So he's gonna cast a uh, another firebolt at uh the gorilla for now. Alright. So here I'll roll it. Yep. Rolling dice, rolling dice. Come on! You miss <laughs> It's wow. in it. It's <laughs> in it. I'm uh, I mean, so worried it's about this thing coming up behind me. <laughs> um, um, but he's just gonna stay right there, I suppose. Yeah, he's all right. All I'll right, Caron, show him how it's done. Uh, all right. Let's start with where is he at? Uh, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. Okay, I'm gonna back up. Um, of, I'm gonna move. Throw a rock as a monkey and then move a little more. Um, so we're gonna go five, ten. Uh, chuck, chuck the rock. Does so you, do you just good. come with a rock? Uh, <laughs> you know what? I guess not. Is there is there a rock in the sand this I can all grab? This fine sand, like the desert. Then I will chuck sand ineffectually. <laughs> um, <laughs> I I have. I have committed to the to the chucking <laughs> plan, to the tossing plan, the throwing plan, as it were. Um, and Maybe so, eyes. say what? Maybe some gets in his eyes, affects his vision. M yeah. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> but one can only hope. Twenty feet yep. away. <laughs> you can only hope. Um. So, uh, ooh, I forgot to bring my rock with me. That's, that's <laughs> That could be your undoing, sir. It could be. Could be. If only I had brought the rock. Um, so, a uh, little, little more limited as a, as a eight. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, no I'm gonna hang out right there. Yeah, yeah. No rock. Um, if, if there is no, if, if <laughs> did, did ineffectually throwing sand cost me my action? It's okay if it did. Because I accept that. If you have a bonus action, I'll let you use it as a bonus action. Okay, I, I mean I should. So I will take the dodge action. Okay, cool. Great, Olaf. All right, so Olaf is tired of not killing people, so he's <laughs> gonna um, walk up here, and if I walk here or here, will I have to make like a 
saving throw? It'll be two and a half feet. So, um, are you your medium size? I guess so. What's your height? Uh, I'm, I, <laughs> I don't matter. think I would define yeah, one. Yeah. <laughs> Let's oh, I did say it. I did six. it. Um, you did it. Yeah. You're you're good. You're good. Okay, so I just walk through. Two yeah. and a half feet. Yeah. All right, and then. And one foot in front of the other. That's right. 15, 20, 25, 30. I'm going to be like, sup. Get him! And, um... I'm going to throw an axe at him. Alright. Throw that axe. Throw that axe. Point blank ring. Did it hit? No. Ching. Oh! Right off the shield. Boom! Do it what? bounces oh. right off. And it's going to land just over here in the sand. Ching, 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 ching. All right. Um, Olaf's going to look up at Brittany and be like, stop distracting me. <laughs> As she's being Kill gagged Brittany. up there. Kill Brittany. What <laughs> <laughs> okay, Brittany. All right. All right, Smite. Uh, all right, Smite is going to move this far. And then, uh, can she take a bonus action to kick the axe into the hole? Yes. Boom. Your axe is gone. You only have one hand axe left, Olaf. Olaf's gonna be like, Steve! <laughs> <laughs> and then, yeah, I'm gonna get right up in that, right up in your face. And I'm gonna swing with my long sword. What's your movement speed? Yeah. Yeah, oh, she okay. that was starting. Yeah. yeah, she got it. Whoa. Okay. She got there. It was closer than I thought it was. <laughs> yeah. Are you hitting, are you hitting like, Olaf or Duncan? Yeah, who are you swinging at? Olaf. Olaf. Does a 19. Got for her, Scott. No, it's what she said. No, I, oh, think, okay. I, I think <laughs> that's what she said. I am the guy who predicts the past. <laughs> you've, you've proven that uh, uh, that Dunka has a pretty high AC, so I was going to try to go for you and <laughs> suss it out. <laughs> Does a 19 hit? Yeah. Sweet. It's a critical hit. Dueling style. Oh. Is that extra damage? or Yes. It is. Yeah. So it's a 10 plus 2, which is a 12. Does that mean... It would be a, the damage dice is doubled, not the modifiers. Right. So, okay, let's see. 22 that was, damage. Yeah. 22 damage. What's your it's, strength modifier? Yeah, it's a 4, uh, so it's 6. So it's 12 plus 4 plus 2. So it's 18. Oof. It, your, so your strength modifier is a is a 4? Is a 4, correct. If you hover over the 10, it'll show you the math. It has it in there, too. Oh, look yeah. at that. Okay. Nicely okay. done. Yep. Thank you. So how much did you do again? Like that. Eight. Wait, I have, I have, 18. 18. It's slashing, it's, it's slashing Slash. damage, right? Yeah, yeah I have yeah. resistance to slashing while I'm in rage. So you have half. It's half, so it's only nine. Okay. Nine points of damage. Good call. That's good. good call. Fine. All right. Well, it's a crit, though, right? <laughs> so it'll... Uh, is it double that? No, she already did double it, and then you. Eighteen is, it. The, is the critical amount of damage. Gotcha, right. Yeah. Dunka. Trying to be fair. Um. Whoa! You come out of nowhere. Uh, <laughs> Dunka's gonna take a swing with his one-handed uh, warhammer here, on um. Now we got a brawl. They just ran up. Yeah. The you may try. Just ran up. <laughs> Nineteen hit. Oh crap! That's a hit. That is a hit. Okay, and you said I can just click on this and it'll do the damage. Mm -hmm. Correct. Uh, so what? That's gonna be ten bludgeoning. So okay. it was a one d eight plus four strength. So the eight times two is sixteen. Then plus the four is twenty. And then, wait, did you roll it twice? Why? Yeah, he did. No, I just I only clicked it once. All right, so ignore the five because the twelve was the first one. Yeah. So it's 8 times 2 is 16 plus 4, so it's 20. 20 bludgeoning. 20 bludgeoning damage right in the back. Um, And then um, I will use my bonus action to try and shove the Warforge closer to the hole, like right here. Mm, you, I, I would... 
I'd consider it moving towards the other hole, but to, like, scoop around and shove doesn't make any sense. No, to, like... No, like, with the Shield Master, I can use oh, my bonus Oh, I was looking at Olaf, I'm sorry. I was looking at Olaf. Yeah, so just try and knock the Warforge yeah. five feet closer yeah. to the hole. Um, so what is it again? It's an athletic, my athletics versus... Versus whatever, whatever she choose. chooses, acrobatics or athletics. Damn. Oof. Woo! You're five feet back, but... Boom, get closer to that hole. It's not there more than five feet, so you slide, but you're, you know, about a foot or so off the edge, or to the edge. You're good. You're good. That's all I can do. All right. Charon. I have a question for the GM. Sure. Um, may I use my Summon Wildfire Spirit class feature uh, while I am in the ape shape? Can your ape cast magic? Um, so no. I would. Well, probably not. I, would, I don't mind that. Um, so are we counting this as like a spell, as like magic? Uh, because Which is okay if, it, if yes, because then I can ignore resistances. If that's the case. Um, I'll say you can do that, but you can't cast magic. Cool. I'm on board with that. Yeah. Then I will um, I will watch this <laughs> this uh, this stats of monkey death and uh, and look around. It is my rock. Uh, ooh, no. Well, y'all have fun. Five, ten, fifteen. <laughs> and I will and I will uh, I will go right here, and I will uh, monkey taunt them as I take the dodge action. <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right, Olaf. <laughs> I'm gonna look over at uh, Dunka, Dunka, Dun Double Dame, Dunka, Dun Dunka, and I'm gonna be like, "Well, thanks for shoving that person right next to me." Um, smite, and Olaf is going to take his great axe and uh, recklessly swing. All right. So uh, advantage. Uh, with advantage, you said? Yeah. Are you raging? Well, unless it's like the relentless. That attack. was, and what was that, about seven, eight rounds ago? Relentless. So we'll say you got this one in like two more. Oh my god. All right. Wait, is it 17 or is it seven? 17. 17. With Smite will block away your pathetic little axe or hammer, whatever you're swinging. Wait, 17's not good enough? No. Nope. It is not. Not for this wow. Warforged. <laughs> I think she's got an 18. Can I use a bonus action to try to shove him into the pit or her? Uh, it's an action to do that. Okay. Um. Bolts on. Well, no, I don't want to do that. Um. And if I'm not uh, mistaken. Uh, one second. Just to let you know, because of Reckless Attack, even though you get advantage, everyone's going to get advantage on their attacks against you until it's your turn next. Uh, uh, crap. That's why it's I'm Reckless. Gonna... It's yeah. more of a last hit kind of thing. I'm going to be like, oh, that didn't go as planned. This person's tougher than they look. And, <laughs> I'm and, a giant you know, machine. <laughs> I look pretty tough. <laughs> and Olaf's just going to kind of kind of put his hands on his hip, and he's going to be like, all right, well, I'm done, I guess. The retaliation of Smite. Oh, yeah, and you said, uh, did so we didn't do Reckless and so no advantage? No, he, has rec he did a Reckless, so you have advantage. Great. Also. So I'm gonna turn on advantage, and I'm gonna take a swing with my longsword at Olaf. Oh man! That's a miss. Jesus. Barely a miss. All right. Well, I'm gonna move just a sidestep a little bit, so I'm not as it far in the hole. All right. That gives you an opportunity attack, Jess, because she left melee range. I use my great great axe for it. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um. All right. And it's still reckless, or. Because it said mm -hmm. uh, until the next turn. It says I get it until the next turn. It is. Yeah. It's got a point. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Mm. So not enough. 19. Oh, that's that a hit. Good. 19? <laughs> that's a 19. Oh, let's go. All right. So it's, it's a crit uh, hit, so it's double damage. 
But we gotta do the math right, so just click on it. Sixteen. So um, it's a twelve plus two plus double. two. You have two because of another ability. Um, so it'd be twelve. <laughs> you got a max um, damage on the twelve. Holy cow! So that's yeah, 24, 25, um, 26, 27, 28. And it's plus two because I'm a level four um, with Divine Fury. And yeah, it's, it's, a one, it's a D6. So 1D6 as well. Ah, so two. okay. So 18, 20 damage. And I think there's something else too that I can do. Yeah, you've got it's okay. it's 26 plus this D6 you're rolling. So okay. that's 28. 26 plus 28. And... I'm out. You're out? I'm out. All right, wow. you're you're technically Wait, she's at she's down, so she's technically having to roll saving throws. But I mean, <laughs> there's no teammates, so <laughs> Olaf's gonna Olaf's gonna look at Dunka and uh, the other guy. I can't remember his name. Sorry, um, and he's gonna be like, "Let's get him." <laughs> Dunka's turn. Oh man. Uh... Oh man. I'm so sorry, Meg, but. Dunk is gonna just <laughs> dead dead robot and swing down. <laughs> um, she's down, so that's like an automatic hit, isn't it? Well, uh, here I'll roll. It's it's not an automatic hit. You and you roll it with advantage, but because she's prone. But if it hits, it's gonna be two fails. You can still Point. miss, and you did. <laughs> You did miss. <laughs> That's an acrobatic uh, dead person. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's uh, so excited to kill you, he's not aiming. <laughs> yeah, I missed. Uh, oh, sh shoot. <laughs> I almost, I'm trying to watch my tongue. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to think how you would get up at this point. I mean, you like. Natural 20 gives her one hit point. Ah. Uh, yeah. So, um, she's not really in melee with me, so I can still move, right? Without, yeah, so five. Yeah, she's unconscious. 10, 20, 25. I'll go right there. That's as far as I'm going to go. Yep. Karen. Uh, three, so many choices. Um, let's see. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll step over here. 5, 10. Go right there. Oh, what's up, uh, bro? Ready? Monkey punch. Uh, we're going to make two attacks with right. the monkey no. fist. No, monkey. That's right. Yes. You can kill someone first before the other one fully dies. Like, nice mm -hmm. plan. So, that is... It. Sorry. Monkey stats. Uh, D20 plus 5 to attack. Let's do that. Bam. Um, 17 for the first one. Bang, right off the shield. Right. Bang. And second attack, 22. <laughs> That's going to hit. Uh, I'm going to use my shield reaction. So that will not hit. Oh, you cast sh the shield spell? Yeah, as a reaction. How much does that give okay. you? It gives plus me five. plus 5 AC, which oh. will be enough to stop that. Nice. Wow. Good call. That's OP. But... What is your AC normally? 18? 18. 19 is my AC. Uh, How do you have a 19 AC? So right? I have chainmail and I have a shield, but then I took the uh, fighting fighting style defense, and that gives me a plus one while I'm wearing armor. So I have a 19 total. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> All right. Uh, Olaf. Um, oh, are you done? Sorry, Karan. So that is. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be done. Oh, man. Okay, it went from like a waiting room to a deep surgery. <laughs> it's going into battle now. All right, Olaf, what are you doing, dude? Olaf's going to um, walk up to my... And Olaf's going to be like, this is for you, Steve. <laughs> and he's going to recklessly attack with his great axe. Uh... You, did, you did kick his hand axe into the pit. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Told you, you're gonna pay for that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, great axe. Seventeen. Not enough. Not enough. Okay. So Wait, strange. did I do it with advantage? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna be like, dang it. <laughs> she's, she's gonna be looking there, like, still dodging everything. Like, I can't. All right. Like, First saves might be strong. What's up? 
first save, Smite. Oh. No. no. Ooh. Ooh. That's a scary one. All right, Dunkin' Donuts. Bad monkey. <laughs> um, <laughs> gonna take a, an attack at the uh, the gorilla here. I think it's a gorilla. Um, you are a gorilla, correct? I am an ape. Yes. All so, right. Yeah. Oh, I'm not rolling with advantage. Don't do that anymore. Bam. Nice. That'll hit. All right. So it's only one d eight plus. Oh, I should have just clicked it in there. Yep. Here, I got it. No, 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 no. That was an attack. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Still getting used to this. Uh... It's all right. Just click it there in the chat, yeah. There we go. 1d8 so plus 4, so 2. Been six so the so... 2 is crit, so it's doubled, so it's a 4. So it's 4 plus 4 equals 8. Okay. Got eight it. Damage. Not bad. I... Um, and then I will use my bonus action to try and uh, shove him with the shield again. All right. Um, so athletics. Ooh, seventeen. What we got? Nice. Solid. Uh, I am rolling athletics as well. All right. I will move five feet. Boom. Shoves you back. You're beside a hole, not in the hole. You're good on the hole. All right. All right. I like that feat so much. Uh, and it's time for his revenge. <laughs> she just comes running right back. <laughs> still, still a monkey, still an ape. Let's let's give it let's give it another shot, shall we? Yeah. There is attack Bring number one. Sixteen. Ooh. Off the shield. Shield up. There's number two. Oh, I dodged that one. All right. That's the, it. The crowd erupts with cheers as they're watching this guy boom, boom, block all that this gorilla is trying to put on him. Olaf. All right. So Olaf's going to walk up to her. Well, I guess I'm still here. And he's going to be like, man, this Terminator dude is just really pissing me off. And then she's, he's going to um, do the great <laughs> again. I promise I will avenge you, Steve. <laughs> Oh my god. That's a miss. She just hit this thing. <laughs> you guys are hitting this ground all around her. Oh, oh, the whole man. crowd starts cheering, Brittany, Brittany, Brittany. <laughs> and the guards are holding Brittany, and Brittany's like, yeah! <laughs> Sounds like they hate you, bro. <laughs> she got another fail. Down. Oh, she got another fail. Oh, no. Smite. Dunka, Duka. Um, sorry, my dog's in here barking his head off. Um, I think Dunk is going to continue his battle with the gorilla at the moment, so I'm going to swing again. That's eight. eight. What we got? Holy sh... Is that a nat... That's a it's nat a nat 20. 20, but all hits are crit right now, so whoop de do. I'm no, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you said I can just click on... All right, so yeah, I just, just click, click on, on Warhammer it, in the we'll chat. Double the damage. All right. Okay. So So the 1d8 was the 3, I think. No. Oh, the... 3, yeah. Okay. So it'd be 6 plus the 4, so 10. Mm -hmm. and what's that other d8? And then plus yeah, the what's... 3. That's an extra 1d8. Did you... I don't know why. Yeah, why are you rolling down it? I just clicked on it once. All right, let's go. Do we have any, here. like, damage? Uh... It's So he rolled a three, and it added the four. That gave us the first number of seven. And then it added the three on top of it from the initial roll. For the so crit. That, oh, for the that crit. crit. That's, so that's why it's a total of ten. Gotcha. If you, yeah, if you actually roll a crit, it does it for you. I forget. Oh, okay, okay, forget. gotcha. Yep, yep. So, oh, so... Should just be ten damage, right? Ten yeah. to Karan. Bam! Just smack him in his gorilla arm. Back Ooh. up. Um, I'll bonus action try and shove him again. I don't know. <laughs> it just seems it just seems fun because <laughs> I can do yeah. it. Uh, Why not? Yeah. What was that? A twenty. All right. No, what he he rolled a twenty. You, you rolled a natural twenty for a twenty-six. Good I rolled God. a modified twenty. Two nat twenties in a row. Bam, dude. All right, Roll shoves you back. Me. It's his turn. <laughs> the dice have chosen. Uh -huh. Unless, unless uh, you're gonna go anywhere, you're gonna use your movement. 
Dunka. Nah, I'm I'm good right here. I like fighting this guy. All right. All right. Uh, with one right, so with one hit point left on the ape, I'm gonna drop the ape for him, and then I will, as an action, summon my uh, foil fire spirit right here, uh -huh. right, so that's within thirty feet, and uh, that means everybody within uh, ten feet of it must make a dexterity saving through, uh, or take two d six fire damage. Uh, that's gonna be an automatic uh, fail from Smite. Yes, it will. <laughs> and so, yeah. just like that, <laughs> the Sorry, audience Smite. goes quiet. The guy stands up from his big purple chair as his guards move over the way. He goes to the edge, and you hear everyone yell, "Call run, call run, call run, call no. run." Don't the go. Wizards Don't go. <laughs> reach around in the entire field. <laughs> Starts to heal up and go back to normal as guards come up and pick up the body of Smite and hold her in the air as everybody jumps in the air and cheers to give respect for the fighter who dared enter the Thunderdome. Whoa! Crowd goes wild! Crowd go wild! The clerics descend upon the field and put their hands upon Charon, Dunka. Uh, Tunkaduka and Olaf and immediately heal their wounds and bring them to level 6. And just like that, that is the first group stage. Level 6 or level 5? Weren't you level 4? Yeah. yeah. Then you're level 6 now. Ah, yeah. I like that. We're going to get a high, high level fight in the, in the, in the finals. This is going to be dope. Um, confetti pops off. There, uh, uh, Celine Dion comes in and starts singing a song. <laughs> Mo uh, big monster trucks jump into the <laughs> crash and explosion. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to Group A's first stage of the Thunderdome. Meg, thanks sorry, for Meg. playing. So sorry. Sorry, Meg. Thank you for being. Thank you for being here. And Jack says thank you. Thanks, Jack. All right, if you're watching us on Twitch or Facebook or YouTube, thanks for watching. Uh, pop back in for uh, Silvernell has a special event this Monday where a separate DM is coming in for uh, in Silvernell. It's going to be really cool. If not, we'll see you Wednesday nights or we'll see you next Saturday. For All right, it's in the cold. Woo! It's going to be great. Have a good night, night. everybody. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Bye.